So hi guys, we're here with the Airstream display at Hershey RV Show. And as you know, we do like our Airstreams. We have one ourselves. And we're gonna get to walk through all these new models and show you what's new in Airstream for 2020. Yep, all the different models, all the different color schemes, all the different uh, floor plans. As each one is unique in their own floor plan. Right, right. And we're going to show you that elusive um, brand new to the public, brand new introduced here at this show, um, Globetrotter 30 foot. So you're going to get to see that when we show you these. So come on along, this should be a lot of fun. Yep, take the tour with us. Yeah. This is a 20 foot Bambi. In the corner here is a 22 foot Bambi. And then the Airstream Nest. This is the Airstream Nest. It is a 16 foot fiberglass trailer. It's the only fiberglass trailer that Airstream builds. And here's Mrs. Zephyr's Travels. What do you think? It's nice. You have to make your bed out of the dinette. Yeah, there is a floor plan that has a regular bed. Oh, there is? Yeah, but you lose a little space. Good size sink. Storage cabinets. Um, two burner stove. More drawers. Mm -hmm. You have a convection microwave. Overhead store storage. Yeah. Small refrigerator. Your electrical panels. This is your wardrobe closet. Pretty good size. And this is your wet bath. Yeah. Don't get a sink. Compact. Then, yep. Yeah. Yeah, you don't get Just have to use kitchen. Right. So this is the Bambi. This would be a 20 foot Bambi. Wow. It has a rear bath. Yeah. This is really nice. I mean, I like. They really upscaled this from what they used to be when they were at sports. Nice size shower. Yeah. With a accordion Tracking. type door. Yeah. Lots of storage. You have a window in your bathroom. A good size wardrobe closet. For such a small trailer, definitely. Uh, waste paper basket. This is the Airstream Atlas Tommy Bahama edition. So you're in a Tommy Bahama Atlas. What do you think of the living area? 
nice nice decor colors. Yeah. Very comfortable. Like the floor. You're always good on the floors. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the floor is nice. Yeah. TV. Big TV, both Bose speaker. Has a bar. Yeah, that's cute. And live the island life. Whoa. So, what do you think of the galley? I like it. Do you? Yeah. Yeah, I like the countertop. The um. Yeah. It's called the faucet. Yeah. <laughs> and the. They have a stove. Yep. Flush. Two burner. Two burner stove. Um, cupboards. Yeah. Plenty of cupboards. The closet. Wardrobe closet. Another closet. Yep. Big, Big mirror. Good Big size medicine, medicine cabinet. Medicine cabinet. A little shelf. Shelf. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this is lovely. A sink here. And Another size of shower. Good size shower. Yeah. Plenty of room. Another cabinet. Mm -hmm. Very livable. Yeah. Oh, it's got the freezer on the bottom. Yeah. Fridge. Oh. Uh, microwave. Microwave. A little high for you, but. Yeah. And then. Is that a convection oven? Oh yeah, it is. A yes. Convection oven. And that folds down into a Murphy bed. Oh, okay. Very nice. Next to it we have an Airstream Caravelle, um, 16 foot, single axle. This is a new model for 2020. It takes the Airstream Sport and takes it a little bit more upscale. The this Caravelle? Is a six, 16 foot Caravelle. I love the floor. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I like this color too. Black. Oh. Is it black? Yeah. Oh, okay. Different kind of stove, but. No. How's that open? There's a little lock. Oh. Right there. Oh. A little refrigerator? Yep. Nice sink. Cupboards. Yep. Kind of your bed and kind of a lounge area behind. Your bathroom. Your bath, yep. Get a curtain to divide it for privacy. Mm -hmm. Wardrobe closet. More um, storage. Yeah. TV's back here. Looks like a comfortable bed. Yeah. Nice size dining room. Yeah. Very nice. Here we have uh, Airstream Caravelle. I think this is probably a 19 or 20 foot front bedroom. Uh, for your shoes down there, a storage area? Oh, yeah. So this is a 22, I think this is a 22 foot caravel. Bedroom is in the front. Shelf bedroom, yeah. Anybody else, you can retail them from lower price. Side janet, which is always nice, big windows. Mm -hmm. Two nice windows. Uh, no, I bet you don't. Trust me, I don't Not need it. It's, it's, it's a breath of fresh air right here. TV and fridge here on the side. Storage underneath the yeah. benches. 
Ooh. Large bathroom. Has an individual shower. Yeah, the regular shower. Very nice. And let me switch positions with you and you can show the kitchen. Very nice large kitchen. Right, plenty of drawers. For the pantry even. They even found a spot to put the pantry. Yeah. You couldn't do that in the 30 foot? Three burner stove. Yep. Four cupboards. Nice. A huge uh, rectangular sink. No, a square sink. Yep. You can wash the baby in there. Yeah. Nice countertop. Yep. More cupboards overhead. Mm -hmm. Very nice. No, no, no. This is an Airstream Globetrotter, 27 foot. We have the air conditioning on. 27 foot Globetrotter with air conditioning. We're just going to spend the rest of the day here. Right. With overhead cabinets. Yeah. And this is a different upholstery. It's a little bit more of a brown. I think so. Yeah. Or, or slate. Mm hmm. Uh, Dinehead area. Yeah. More overhead storage. Square sink. Plenty of drawers. Yeah. An oven. Your microwave is in the drawer. Yeah. Appears to be close. Fridge here on the side. A little smaller. A nice size wardrobe closet. Right. Yeah, I would like a bigger wardrobe closet. Or we would. Yeah. Again, you have the across the hallway shower. Shower, yeah. And we'll do the bathroom early back. Yeah. Very nice. I like the um, little um, seating area there. Or whatever yeah. you want to call it. Yeah. We have that. Ah, it's nice. Tell them to put your leg up on when you shave it. Mm -hmm. Or to sit as you get older. Right. So this, this could be either um shirt locker or or wardrobe closet. You can remove the shelving. I think the same in this one. Yep, this is the same. So it has a shelving that you can remove. Mm -hmm. Twin beds. Twin beds. Another uh, vanity type area yep. with a drawer. This is kind of shallow. More storage underneath. Yeah. One thing that they do on these, which, which is nice, is uh, the back, the headrest area, mm -hmm. is padded. That's nice. Yeah. Yeah. Little storage areas on each side. Mm-hmm. I like that. Yep. Yeah. We have we well we have a small space. What's right. their wheel well? Yeah. Nice size toilet sink, nice size counter. We have the overhead medicine cabinet. Right. And another shelf here for your towel. There's a window in the door. Yeah. Very nice, and even though it's got a dark color upholstery, it's very light and airy mm -hmm. in here with a light covers and uh, countertop. Right. Very comfortable. What air conditioning? Yeah. This is a Globe Trotter 25 foot. Globe Trotter. Oh, this, sorry, this is the 24 foot Globe Trotter. overhead storage cabinet. Mm -hmm. A 
place to put your waste paper basket. Yep. It already comes with a waste paper basket. A nice sink and faucet. Yep. Pantry, pantry, large pantry. Like a bath, rear bath. Wow, good size rear bath. Yeah. And large shower. Cupboards. Nice good size cupboard. A lot of storage back here. This would be a very nice unit for a older couple who, or a couple who want to travel, maybe not full time, but it would be very nice for you know extended vacations, weekends. Yeah. A lot of drawers. Another waste paper basket. Yeah. Nice stove. Yeah, I like the stoves they're putting in these now. Yeah, they're the flush, flush mounted with your countertop. Yeah. Three burner stove. Oven. Mm-hmm. No. Oh, what that was up there? Let's go back. Okay. Compartments here. Yeah. And the U-shaped dinette. Very nice. Very nice. Another compartment. Yeah. Overhead cabinet. Yeah. And your audio equipment's up here. So your Blu-ray player and um, radio. Refrigerator. Yeah. That's new. The shelving. Yeah, that's so a different style refrigerator than what we have, what they've been putting in to their other ones. Mm -hmm. I think this is the freezer. Freezer, yeah. I think this is the, the three way electric refrigerator. Yep, three way electric. Nice flooring. Mm hmm. A wardrobe closet, good size. And back here we have twin beds. Yeah, very spacious. Another wardrobe. Another uh, wardrobe closet. A sure locker. A little pull-out drawer here. Vanity. And this is the new touch they've been doing on with the curtains on the windows. Mm-hmm. More overhead storage. Yeah. You see they put a up here. They're adding a blind to the vent so that you can block out the light. You're sleeping. So it's very nice. Yeah. This is a flying cloud, 26 foot. Has a U-shaped dinette. This is a 26 foot. This is the U-shaped front dinette, which is very unique. It's a, at the time they always called it a very European layout. Your TV is up yep. here for good viewing. And here, this can be a coat locker. It's also storage for the, the tabletops. If you want to take the tabletops down and make this into just a lounge area, you can put them in here. They have the round sink in this unit. Yep. Nice faucet. Overhead cabinets. Yeah. Cool. Cabinet space. Drawers with your cutlery. There's your waste paper basket, which is always nice when they include that. Your flush mounted um, Stove. Glass top. That is really nice. Mm -hmm. That is a definite upgrade over what we have. Right. What if we can add that? And a convection oven. Yep. Large pantry. Big pantry. Yeah. Another cupboard. Storage. Come back to the bathroom. So this is a twin bed model. Let's see, you have the um, vanity between, large drawer. 
you get a shirt locker here with or shelves so you can do either. Adjustable shelves so you can take them out yeah. from your wardrobe closet. More storage overhead. Overhead lid, yep, and across the back. You get the wraparound rear windows, which is uh, always a plus. Mm hmm. More um, storage underneath the beds. You have a couple drawers here. And these are deep. Mm hmm. That's a storage compartment down there. And there is a cubby here that allows you to store things. Your TV. And I guess you would call that a hat storage. <laughs> Yeah, it's got hooks. Yeah. So let's do the bathroom because the bathroom is unique. Why don't you get in front of me? So this has an all in one bath with shower. Nice shower. Yeah. Large shower, probably bigger than ours. Yeah. And then you've got your sink and toilet and cabinetry on the side here. The only thing you don't really get, and there's really not a lot of room for it, is a large mirror. Mm -hmm. and you do get a window in that door. Right. So this is a nice layout. Very nice. This is a 24 foot flying cloud. This is a 24 foot corner bed. So you get a front dinette. And this a is a flying cloud. Flying cloud trim, yes. Front dinette. You get a couch, center kitchen. Round sink, yep. nice faucet. And you get a lot of storage here. Your waste paper basket. With additional access on the side here. Convection oven. Yeah. Again, the flush mounted. Yep, that uh, must be new to all of them this year. Stove. Pantry or cover, whatever slides out. Yeah. Is that a. Another cover for storage? Yeah, your linen closet or whatever. Wardrobe closet? Yeah. Two of them because you have one on the other side. Right. Pretty good size. Your sink is out here. Yeah. Small round, round sink with cupboards underneath. Mm -hmm. And this is what's kind of unique is that this door is a multi-function door. So when you're on the outside, you can have it like it was before where it's taking away space from the bathroom, but if you're going to be in the bathroom, you can move the door around this way and it'll give you more space in the bathroom. In privacy. In privacy. Yep. Inside the bathroom is a nice size shower. Yep. And your toilet. It's rather small, but... But it's a small unit, so... Yeah, that's true. And then you have your corner bed. Cool. You know, warm. We're going to find the ones with the air conditioning running. We got a little background noise of, an air, of a generator running next to us. Here is a 30 foot classic. Wow, look at the space here. What size is this? This is 30. Just up the side, so I can find some lights. Ceiling lights here. No, no lights. I got them all blinking. <laughs> hmm? Nice size couch. I think it has reclining chairs. Yeah. Overhead storage. Yeah. And this way. I like this. They put you know, something on the walls. Yeah. Dress it up a little bit. Good size 
sink, faucet, good size countertop, mm -hmm. flush mounted uh, um, stove, right. three burner shelf, microwave, microwave, oven, cabinet with your waste paper basket, drawers, your TV is mounted here. Right. Refrigerator. Good size refrigerator. Mm-hmm. Freezer. Large center wardrobe. A nice wardrobe. A accordion door for privacy. Shower is on the opposite side of your bathroom. Right, so it's a center bath. This right here, and then so this is the queen bed. And it has a TV. Overhead storage. Yep. Does this have storage underneath? Storage the bed? underneath. It's also, if you can see, it the mattress tilts. Mm. You have blinds instead of curtains. Yep, so you have the day and night blinds. Those are very nice. In the bathroom? Wow. The bathroom is wonderful. Look at this huge mirror. Yeah. Nice counter space. Different size or shape of sink. Is this a heated towel rack? Yep. Is the floor heated? The, it has baseboard heat, baseboard radiant heat. Oh. It's an Aldi system. Oh, okay. You know what's on the back of the door? Large mirror. Large mirror. I like this. You said this is a 30 foot? 30 foot. Wow. I love this open space here. Yeah. The dogs would love it. Yeah. So this is your full-time rig? Yeah, it's very nice. A 33-foot classic. How big is this? This, this is, is a 33-foot. Beds. Okay. TV. Yeah, this one has well. What's the countertop called? Um, Korean. Korean top countertop. Yeah. Nice wood. Your doors are wood for your overhead storage. Twin beds. wardrobe closets on either side. That's nice. Have a door for privacy. Drawers underneath. Nice large, refrigerator. Very large refrigerator. Wow. For an RV that's pretty nice. Oh, that's an open. Nope. It's stuck. We won't mess with that. So let's walk down the kitchen. So this has microwave and stove. Flush mounted. Um, stove. Stove. Yeah, well, I should say microwave and oven and flush mounted stove. Mm-hmm. Large sink. Yeah. Nice faucet. Four cupboards underneath. Your has drawers underneath too. Yeah. For your silverware and whatever you want to put in it. Overhead storage. Good size. 
Do we have your diet? Yes. They have, these are different. Right, your blinds are all behind there. Yeah. One of the things it has up here is a projection, I have a DVD player, but there's also a projection TV and a screen that will come down here. And this, you end up with like a 70 inch TV. Wow. And then these are recliners. This is an office area. And you've got a drawer here for storage. You've got a spot here for files. Large wardrobe in the back here. That's water pump. It's a light. I love this sink. Vessel sink. Mm -hmm. Cabinets underneath. Mm -hmm. Good size cabinets. Medicine cabinet. And a huge, another large shower like that Tommy Bahama. Very large shower. Yeah. The heated towel rack. The flower, sh the shower floor is heated. It has radiant heat throughout. Wow. More um, Luba storage there. Yeah. I don't know what to do with those. More cabinets overhead. Mm -hmm. A shelf here for, I guess, whatever you want to put there. Your tissues. So is this what you want for full time living? This would be nice. Did you ever say this could be an office space? Yeah, it comes yeah, with office, its own chair. Comes with an office chair. Very nice. So this is a 30 foot flying cloud bunkhouse. This is a 30-foot flying cloud bunkhouse. Front bedroom has a queen bed in the front. It's got closets on either side. Yep. Storage cabinets overhead. Storage underneath the bed probably too. Mm -hmm. TV. Um, to have your privacy, they have a private door. Packet oh. door. Oh, no, no okay. not Korean door. door. Yeah. Storage for your shoes under there. That's always a nice touch. Yeah. U-shaped dinette. Mm-hmm. They need a new design for their pillows. <laughs> yeah, because the same as we have. Mm -hmm. I think every year they design them. Different design. Mm -hmm. Um. St uh, cupboard for storage and your waste paper basket. Yeah. This so, unit has the round sink in it. Yeah, the clouds all seem to have the round sink in them now. Flush mounted um, stove. Stove. This has the convection microwaves, <laughs> so you don't get the oven. Mm-hmm. But you do get drawers. There yeah. appears to be plenty of drawers. Yeah. More drawers on this side too. Another cabinet. Another bed. Two beds. Two beds. Yeah, this is a bunkhouse. Mm-hmm. Wardrobe up here, yeah. More drawers. Yeah. Wardrobe closet. Refrigerator. Mm. Here's your bathroom. Family bathroom, because this would be a family rig. All right. Nice size shower. Yeah. Have a mirror on the door. Oh, well, that's a good touch. I also have a small makeup mirror. So, would you be happy with this 
If you had one that had the makeup mirror? No. Okay. Keep that in mind. It doesn't have, you know, it's a shelf. I'm not shelving them. Mm -hmm. Look very nice. It has a little fan. Look at the knobs. How cool. Mm hmm. Here we have a 27 foot International Serenity. And what's unique about this is it has the rear hatch. And we'll show you that here. So this is a 27 foot Serenity. And it has International. International Serenity. And it has the rear hatch. As you can see, so that will completely open. And then that's the um, screen that comes down. Yep. Overhead cabinets. Mm -hmm. with, this time with a sliding door. Right. This is your, your lounge area. Lounge area with under, under the lounge storage. We have the round sink. Round sink, yep. Different faucet. Yeah. Looks very modern. Under under sink storage, good size. Yep. With your trash can there. Plenty of drawers. Microwave. Separate microwave and oven. Yep. How many burners? Three burners. Three burners stove. This has center. I used to always have a really nice large closet in the middle. Mm-hmm. Very nice. Yeah. Your shower is across from your bathroom. Yep. Probably, I don't know, does it look the same size as ours? Very similar. Mm -hmm. It's on the opposite side. Right. And you have the rear bedroom with the wraparound window. Mm-hmm. And this actually, this would be the front bedroom because this is the front of the unit. With your queen size bed? Queen size bed, yeah. With storage underneath? Yep. And Nightstands on either side with, with a cabinet. cabinet. No. Oh, this is. Can nice. go in the bathroom? Show me the bathroom. Sure. Sorry, so here. This is the bathroom. Compact but usable. Actually, not too compact. No? I mean, same size as ours, basically. Oh, it has the overhead man medicine cabinet. Yep. So it has two uh, two compartments. Yep. Another cabinet under the sink. Small round sink. Mm -hmm. This is even a bigger. Isn't it big? It's a bigger mirror. Bigger mirror. It's a full or, size cabinet. Yeah. Yep. Door or medicine cabinet? Yeah. I think they mount the just mount the mirror. What's it? Yeah. So they come with a better way to mount the mirror. Well, it's a different because we have two mirrors. So you like this? Um. I like the dark wood. Oh, like I mean, it's it's very pretty, but yeah, I do like the floor. Yeah, dark floor. Mm-hmm. So this is the 27-foot Serenity with the rear hatch. So 
take a look at what that's like. It wasn't open when we were here before. So we just want to come back and share that. So you can see you get a very nice open back end. Nice breeze. Mm -hmm. Ventilation. We were in here, but the, the back end wasn't open. Right, right, exactly. That's what I was saying. Feature. Yeah. This is a brand new model. This is a 30 foot globe trotter. So, this is the 30 foot. Globe trier, brand new floor plan and model for this year. Mm -hmm. And as you can see, it's got a very large lounge area. And what you can see here is there is a table that is in the lower position right now. So this would make a bedding, bed area. And back there, that would be a bed. Um, or you could leave it like this and put your feet up mm -hmm. if you wanted to. Your TV's on the wall over here. Yeah. Cabinets that are overhead and lit. Kitchen on the side. Nice Squares. countertop. Yeah, nice Korean countertop. Good size sink. Square sink. Mm -hmm. And this has the sprayer in it. Big wow. drawers. Plenty of drawers. Yep. Flush mounted um, stove. Stove. Storage. Yep. Is that a regular oven or come back? Regular oven, so that should be the microwave. There it is. And here's the microwave. And then you have pantry storage underneath. Big refrigerator. And this is the 30 wood refrigerator. So you have center closet. Bathroom's a little bit different. Well, maybe not. I don't know. It's, it's, so it's got a good size. Shelf. Yeah. Medicine cabinet. Yeah. Another overhead shelf there. Plenty of storage. Good size cabinet. Mm hmm. They hid the toilet roll inside the cabinet. Yeah. That'd be good for when you travel down the road, doesn't unroll. Right. That's a good idea. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty good size. Got a window in the doorway. Your shower is across the hallway. Right. Good size shower. Yep. And in the back, queen bed. Queen size bed. With a wraparound rear window. Mm hmm. Two overhead cabinets. Right. Over here, you have your television. Mm hmm. And this floor, all, like floor plan, that like a lot of them are also available in twin beds. So what do you think? Hmm. I like having the separate dining out. Yeah. And unless you're sitting back here, I mean to sit on the side, you, if you were watching TV, you'd have to turn your head all the time. Right. Right. Mm -hmm. But it's okay. You have another little storage There's area. There's a trash under. Yeah. yeah. I don't know where they hid that. There's, yes. Yeah. I mean, it's very nice. It's with all, all the different layouts. There's always something you like, and there's always something that's not quite, right. you know, and you have to figure out how that all works out. Mm -hmm.
we finished our second day here at the Hershey RV show mm -hmm. and we got to see a lot inside of a lot of the different units we went through all the airstreams right we checked out the interiors the color schemes what amenities were in each of them yeah so it was uh, very interesting and uh, it was nice to be able to get in to, you know ahead of the open to the public day well, tomorrow's the first day for the public so it will be a lot more crowded tomorrow when we go in there and so we may not get to see as much but right. we're going to get around and see a few more things mm -hmm. tomorrow and see what we can find and uh, enjoy ourselves but it's been a really good time yep it was a good day yep and so if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and and subscribe to our channel Yep, and hit the notification bell so that we notify you when we post new videos. We try to post videos on a weekly basis. This week we're posting them a little bit more frequently because of the RV show. and We want to get a lot of content out to you in a timely manner. So you like this and follow along in our adventures. Thanks, guys. We'll see you down the road. See you down the road. Bye. Bye.